In this tutorial, we're going to show you the nine steps for couldn't connect to Steam Network error. So you can solve your could not connect to Steam Network error by these tutorial. So here's that. This is the error we can get when we are trying to connect to Steam. So you have to do these things in order to get your connection fixed. Try these steps first. The first steps we're gonna reset our IP address by TCP IP. So you can download the reset TCP IP natural utility and then try this with the connection open this file so here's the easy fix so continue the next steps and your connection will be reset automatically Another thing is the WinSock reset. WinSock reset is very simple. So go into your CMD and the command button you can write net sh int ip reset and choose your disk disk name c slash and reset another command is try this net sh winsock reset then press the enter button on the keyboard and exit then restart your computer after the rebooting your computer if you get still this error you can continue these nine steps so we are on this step the fourth step shows you full PC scan. So scan your computer against viruses. So we're scanning our whole computer by AVG internal security. Also update your Steam. This is very simple too. Go to your Steam and update it. The another thing is troubleshoot your Steam network connection. You can troubleshoot the connection by Windows applications itself. The seventh step is Firebind test. So you can f try this Firebind for the connectivity assurance. Here's a free trial for the Firebind test. You can download the tool from here and test your connection. Update all of your programs and then troubleshoot your net network again. After all of these steps, if you are getting the same error, the same connectivity error, you can try to go over 
your program files and steam and also try to delete your config file click the delete button and completely delete this whole config folder and also click on your program files folder and go again the steam folder you can see your steam apps and steam execution files so delete all of this and this execution file and try to replace with the new one and open your task manager and go to steam bootstrapper app you can find it run and type in the cd program files and cd steam and steam dot execution file tcp and all it's done then go to your task manager and then process and click and remove the steam error reporter and then steam if you still get errors please command on the gamesloppity.com well, thanks for watching us.